How's it going guys and welcome back to the channel today. So today we're going to be continuing reacting to season four of My Hero Academia. So the last episode, in all seriousness, wasn't my favorite one, but there it did lead on to what looks like this episode should be a little bit more exciting but there was some nice stuff in the last episode the conversation between all might and endeavor was a particular highlight in that one for me you know have them two having a conversation that we never really seen them have before and you know endeavor just kind of almost coming to to all my in a weird way for help you know to, to get a little bit more of an understanding we also saw all of the guys trying to get their their provisional license and it looks like that we're probably going to see this all kick off now these children look like they don't fuck about and i'm really really excited to see how they're gonna fight these kids like these are actual kids like little little kids and shit so i'm looking forward to see how this is gonna go down just before we get in today's video guys if you would like to see early access double episode versions of all the videos on this channel my patreon is live and down in the description below we have exclusive series we have early access opening and ending reaction videos we've like discord server roles and a bunch of other cool stuff so if you want to check that out the link is down below all right enough talking let's get into this shit so guys hit that like button down below helps boy out hit that subscribe button and let's get it by the way there is some dude drilling outside my house so if you guys pick that up I i'm sorry <laughs> Ooh. So that's quite interesting, you know. So as we see, you know, time go on and generations go forward, we're actually gonna see more weird quirks, you know, because all these people, their quirks are gonna mix. We're gonna start seeing weird blends and hybrids of things. So naturally, they're gonna get more and more strong. So, you know, that's fun because that just means we're gonna get more creative quirks, and it's interesting to see how strong can kids be, you know. Damn, they're not scared at all. <laughs> oh, clever. I think we've all been that little kid before that sees the adults and think I, I am an adult I am big I can do whatever but really you're just a kid but in this world where quirks can really like even out shit it's hard to really argue if, if that is the case you know you never know how strong these kids are so looking forward to seeing what's gonna go on here especially this main kid because he seems to be like the main dude out of all of them as well so Curious to see what he's going to have up his sleeve because he seems to have an influence over everyone else and he just has this different kind of vibe about him that I'm kind of interested in. Oh, that looks awesome. Whoa. This is awesome how they've combined their powers to look at this. Damn, this looks mad. See, these kids have quirks and they know how to just use their quirks, but now they're seeing like, well, this is another level. This is how you can use quirks in cool ways, you know, how you can really utilize them, not just the same one move, you know. And and it just looks so badass how they managed to like kind of fuse all their little things together. I That is badass. Oh, I like that. I really like what Bakugo just did. He kind of disarmed it by saying, you're their leader, right? So he immediately gave the kid, like, respect. And the kid noticed that. But then he also gave him advice, which is undeniable. 
So he's given that kid respect and motivation at the same time without having to attack him. Genius stuff by these guys. Like they've done that. That is a real good rather than beating them down and making them feel low. They've raised them up and made them feel inspired and motivated. That is so cool. Straight up, Pat. Oh, man. I want them to be friends so bad. It's really kind of sad because you want them to, you, you want. Todoroki to have that with his dad, but you understand the brutal kind of upbringing that he had. And then, yeah, just to kind of see that, it's kind of like, are we foreshadowing that we're going to be friends in the future? I don't know. I don't know. <laughs>。<laughs>。<laughs> Oh man, don't. I really liked Night Eye, man. It's so sad. Oh, interesting. I really hope we learn a little bit more about Eri, you know, we see a little bit more with Mirio, you know, what's going to be the future with him, because it's such a fascinating thing, and, you know, the fact that we lost Naitai because of it, I hope it's not just something that just kind of gets relegated to the past, and that they do keep on with this, because there's still so many unanswered questions, and a lot of hope, especially in the fact that they might be able to use her ability to kind of bring Mirio's back as well, because we know how promising Mirio was, he had the potential to be one of the greatest heroes ever, so... I really, really hope we, we learn a little bit more about that and what's happening with the League of Villains as well. <laughs> Strange things. Why am I getting weird ass vibes? What the hell? What the hell is this dude creeping on him for? I know. Why is this dude acting like a creep for? What is what the hell does he know? And why are you spelling that shit out with cheese, man? <laughs> Back to the element moves, okay. <laughs> what is up with this dude? Do you reckon he knows about the thing with him and All Might? Oh, he got his quote passed down to him, maybe, then. Oh, 
Or maybe he doesn't know that. He just thinks that he needs that suit to control his quirk. Maybe, I don't know. Ah. Well, there you have it. That's that episode over. Interesting episode. Um, yeah, I really, really like the fact, you know, that the, the whole concept of the, how they got their provisional licenses. I thought that was a nice bit of character development for Todoroki, Bakugo and the rest. Also seeing that little moment with Endeavor and Todoroki was, I feel like an important foreshadowing of what might come in terms of character development for Endeavor. Um, the rest of the episode, I could have taken it or leave it. I didn't feel like it was necessarily that important, but it was still fun nonetheless. Let me know down in the comments what you guys think. You know, these kind of episodes that are a little bit slower. I've heard that this part of season four is a little bit slow, but let me know down in the comments what you guys think. Obviously, no spoilers, of course. Um, but yeah, with that said, that's absolutely everything for this video. So guys, if you have enjoyed it, please do leave the thumbs up down below. It really does help the channel out. But until next time, take care of yourselves and I'll see you soon. Peace.